with the first pick in the 2017 NBA Draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select Markel Fultz from the University of Washington. Well, they're getting a guy who's got an NBA frame already. He's got great length, and he's a three-level scorer. He can score from deep, he can score in the middle game, and he can score at the rim. Great body balance, by far in this draft, the best pick-and-roll ball handler in the, in the draft. He's essentially a James Harden clone. So what's up YouTube Brody, Sevi is my name and welcome back to my channel. If you haven't pressed the subscribe button yet, please press it right now, here over here. And if you haven't pressed the like button, press it at the end of the video because you will like this video. Wait lang, kailangan ko ng cap ang pangin ng ulo ko. So this is the best cap that I can find and yes. I'm gonna try something new by telling you the story of Markel Fultz and his roller coaster ride story. So guys, comment down below if I should continue these kinds of videos for the future. Let's go to the video! Woo! So this is the story about the roller coaster ride career start of Markel Fultz. This story is particularly filled with ups and downs, happiness, sadness, and a lots of injuries. So before everything, let's start from the beginning. Markel popped in the basketball scene while playing in college for the Washington Huskies. He averaged a whopping 23.2 points in the 25 games that season. That point average was also the highest mark in the Pac-12 in over 20 years. He also averaged 5.7 assists and 5.9 rebounds, all in all in 35 minutes. Of course, he received the first team all Pac-12 honors and the third team All-American award in his one and done college career. His scouting report actually says, he jumps off the page athletically and possesses creative scoring instincts and playmaking skills. This scouting report and his whopping 23-point average in the regular season of his college career actually boosted him in the top one spot in the 2017 NBA Draft over Lonzo Ball and Jason Tatum. Everyone thought he was gonna have a good career, but in the duration of the NBA 2017 season, something went wrong. On his first NBA game, Fultz scored 10 points, 3 rebounds, and 1 assist in 18 minutes. Looking at those stats, it was very impressive for a rookie, wasn't it? But this won't last long when the issues started to arise about his shoulder injury. First, reports started to say that it was a scapular muscle imbalance. Then, Reports said it was a psychological problem because that so-called injured shoulder is the same shoulder he uses to dunk. Whatever happened to him, he was put into a very lengthy recovery where his shot changed and this happened. Yes, that's what happened to Markel Fultz's shot. Air balls, a hitch, and a double clutch shot, which led to a very poor 33% shooting from the field. This is very low for an NBA caliber player. Markel Fultz, the number one pick, is now a bust in the eyes of fans and analysts everywhere. In this story, it is not all negative. When he shocked the world by posting a triple double of 13 points, 10 rebounds, 10 assists in his last regular season game with the Philadelphia 76ers. This would actually make him the youngest NBA player to ever record a triple-double. In the next season, however, there were changes in the rotation which made Markel Fultz the starting shooting guard for the Philadelphia 76ers. But this positive would not last because due to the continuous shoulder problems he was having, this led him to sit on the bench and through trades with the Miami Heat, Jimmy Butler came and rest is history. The downs just keeps on piling up as NBA agents, the Raymond brothers announced that Fultz will not play in any more practice or regular season games if he is not given a shoulder injury evaluation. With the evaluation done, they came up with another injury for Markel Fultz, which is called the TOS or Thoracic Outlet Syndrome. 
This affects nerves between the neck and shoulder which results to abnormal movement which affected Markel Falk's ability to shoot. Markel Fultz already hit his rock bottom, but in this roller coaster ride career, he would slowly get better when he was traded to the Orlando Magic. While playing for the Orlando Magic, Markel Fultz got out of his shell and developed into a new man. This new man would actually be the number one draft pick that we have been looking for. Markel Fultz with his new jump shot led to him having new and better confidence levels that we haven't seen before. Markel is now posting better shooting percentages on 47% shooting from the field and would average 12.1 points which is higher than any average in his NBA career. He became the lead facilitator in the Orlando Magic Association by posting 5.2 assists this season. The NBA fans would actually blow up again when he scored his career high 25 points, 5 rebounds, 4 assists, and 2 steals in a win against Brooklyn. Now this is the Markel Fultz we've all been waiting for. Sadly, this roller coaster ride full of happiness, sadness, and triple doubles would actually be held to a standstill because of the coronavirus. But I truly believe the future is bright for Markel Fultz. That was a very inspiring story. You need to be a Markel Fultz in your life. You must never give up in your dreams and aspirations even when hit with criticisms and bashings, injuries or whatever the hindrance is. You must always go on with what you have and always believe in yourself. And that is the story of Markel Fultz. So yun nga guys, thank you for watching my video and if you haven't clicked that subscribe button, please click it again <laughs> para mats ko subscribe. <laughs> Hit that like button also to show support to my very small channel but I believe my 59 subscribers are always here to support me. So let's go! Road to 1K! Woo!